Hi, my name is Max Robot. I'm the head of product for Cirrus. Today I'm going to talk to you about the Cirrus Asia syringe pump. Cirrus is an engineering company which develops, constructs and sells scientific equipment for chemists. We offer solutions for both batch chemistry and fluid chemistry. We are based in UK, but we do sell all around the world through our local subsidiaries or our network of distributors. So what do you need to do flow chemistry? To start flow chemistry, you need a pump, you need a reactor, which can be a glass micro reactor or a tube reactor like here, and you need a back pressure regulator in order to unlock some of the advantage of flow chemistry, such as being able to heat your solvent above the boiling point, also called superheating. Arguably, the most important part of the system is a pump. Why is a pump so important? In fluid chemistry, one of the key reaction parameters is the residence time. In order to vary your residence time, you have two choices. You can change your type of reactors, but then you'll be limited by hardware. Or the easy solution is to vary the flow rate. So you want your pump to be able to deliver a wide range of flow rates with high accuracy and precision. You also want your flow chemistry pump to be able to pump any type of reagent and solvent so that it doesn't limit your chemistry, so you want maximum chemical resistance. You also want a pump that's easy to service and maintain because obviously the pump will go through wear and tear and will, have, uh, will need parts to be replaced. Historically, people who were starting with fluid chemistry were using three types of pumps. HPLC pumps, single barrel syringe pumps, and uh, dual syringe pumps. All those pumps are drawbacks. HPLC pumps are mainly designed for operating at high flow rate and high pressure, and therefore they lose a lot of their precision and accuracy at lower pressures and lower flow rates. Also, the material of construction is mainly metal, so they are not as highly chemically resistant as you would like. Single uh, barrel syringe pumps are limited by the volume of the syringe. On the syringe is fully dispensed, you can't refill it. Plus they are very limited automation, which means they're not necessarily suited for the walk-away experiments. Dual syringe pumps are to a certain degree fine and they are used in lots of um, mesoscale fluid chemistry systems. They offer good chemical resistance, but unfortunately they are limited by the pressure range, which usually doesn't exceed 5 bar. So with all those requirements in mind, Cirrus designed the first ever flow chemistry pump specifically designed for fluid chemists, the Asia syringe pump. The pump has two channels, each independent. Each of those channels is made of three parts, the valve, the pressure sensor, and the syringes. Pressure sensors are very important because they enable safety on your pump. The pump has an automatic shutdown built in when an overpressure is detected and also when pressure cannot be achieved, cannot be reached, which is usually a sign of leakage, the pump will stop automatically. The pump can be controlled from the turn and twist and click wheel or connected to a computer by a USB cable and fully automated by the Asia Manager software. The pump is easy serviceable by removing the two thumb screws at the bottom, you can then pull out the full block and then access each individual part, such as the syringes or the valve block. So you can service the pump with minimum effort and no tools required. The pump allows you to access flow rates from 1 microliter per minute up to 10 milliliter per minute. In order to enable maximum precision, you have to select the right syringe size for um, each flow rate that you want to achieve. The pumping mechanism is called V2V and uses two syringes that enable a continuous flow of solvent or reagent. When one of the syringe is pulling to refilling, the other one is dispensing the volume out in the system. All the weighted parts are glass and PTFE, enabling maximum chemical resistance. 
Cirrus offers a wide range of modules for fluid chemistry. All those modules can be assembled in, the, in different types of systems, but all the systems have one thing in common, the Cirrus Asia syringe pump. This pump is the first pump that has been developed specifically for fluid chemistry. It's a high performance pump that enables you to access a wide range of chemistries. For more information, please have a look at www.series.com.